Hi guys, Anna here from Anna Cherry Caribbean Kitchen. Welcome back to my cooking. Today I'm going to show you how I do my winter soup. Perfect for the weather, it's full of different flavors. Take a walk here in the backyard, full of snow. I don't have to put up any Christmas trees. Uh, there's Christmas trees in the backyard, already decorated with that snowfall. Very beautiful. Let's go to the grocery to pick up our ingredients to make our winter soup. Come on, let's go. Here I have here the ingredients. Beef bone, I have cubed beef, I have sweet potato, carrots, cassava, edos, red bell peppers, and broccoli, okras, cilantro, and corn. I have here butternut squash, vegetable broth, onion in a mix pack there, cream style corn, some pasta of your choice. Here I have everything washed and chopped up here already. I also have um, cream of potato in the back there. We're just going to be using a very little of that and some all-purpose seasoning. The beef bone and the beef cubes has been washed already. I have the seasoning to season it up there. Black pepper, paprika. Here I have some black pepper goes in. Some paprika goes in. All purpose seasoning. A little salt. Adubo. Green seasoning. And garlic. Give it a mix. Let it soak for about 20 minutes before cooking. So all that flavor from the seasoning will get into that meat to marinate it. That beef bone is going to give me soups for about three times. In a hot pot with oil, you're going to add your beef bone and your beef cubes. Give it a mix. Let it fry up a little bit. Cover it, let it cook up a little bit. When it changes or turns color, you can add your fine thymes, your sprig of fine thyme, some ketchup, soy sauce goes in, give it a mix. That will flavor up the meat and give it a color. Top it off with hot water. You're going to cover this and let it cook until your beef is soft. That's your natural beef broth there. In goes our chopped provisions, sweet potato, cassava and edos, your onion mix and your butternut squash goes in, and your vegetable broth, cream style corn, You're going to cover that and let it cook. Let all your provisions halfway cook. Then you're going to add your corn. Top it off with some water again. And you're going to cover this and let your corn and provision continue cooking. As well as your meat will continue to get softened. After your corn and your provision is cooked, you're going to add your chopped carrots and some of your chopped cilantro. Your okros. And you're going to cover this until your okra is halfway cooked through as well. Once 
once our okra is halfway cooked through you're going to add your pasta of your choice let the pasta cook here now then you're going to add your chopped red bell pepper we want our red bell pepper red bell pepper to be on the crunchy side as well too not too soft and our broccoli will go in your broccoli don't take long to cook you want it to be a nice bright green color looks good eh And a little bit of that cream of potato don't add too much otherwise your soup will get on the thick thick side and we want it not too thick and not too thin and the rest of your cilantro goes in a little bit of green seasoning that consists of bandania garlic and peppers and that's it it smells amazing our winter soup is all finished